running. Gotta go do some adjustments, but it's probably gonna stall out from all the oil I have in the cylinder, or maybe not. Running good. off now. Alright. Well, she runs. It's alive. Thank you, honey. <laughs> hey, my wife out here helping me. Well, yep. Yeah, um, new top end. And what I had to do, you can't really see let me get over here up in that side the coil wire was all cut up on this thing and everything I need a new coil for it basically the wire is short now because it had to wrap the, the wire had wrapped all around here and then went on but whoever had it or or, or done it before me they um cut the wire I mean, it must have thought the bike was having an electrical issue because it was just low, really low on compression, which obviously I fixed that. But they, they cut on a coil wire, put electrical tape and everything around it, and the reading I was getting was like 133 or something like that when it should have been 6. Like, or no, 10 to 16 is what the cap, the when you test the cap to ground, it should be 10 to 16. I was getting a hundred and like almost 130. But yeah, new top end. Coils fixed. Um, obviously I need to get the right plastics for it, but these will do now so I can at least just ride the damn thing. Um, it was street ridden. <laughs> As you can change tight as hell. Well, not super tight, but I need to Loosen it up, adjust the chain, take some slack, or put some slack in it. But yeah, freaking fires right up first kick, man. I love it. Happy, happy as hell now.